Hey guys, it's Abby and today we're going to continue the journaling on a budget series. So I'm here at Miniso at the podium and let's go inside and see what we can find under 500 pesos. haul from Miniso and I'm gonna show you some of the things I got so first off I couldn't really find a blank notebook so I decided to go for this linen cover memo book it's 48 sheets and oh apparently it has something written below it it says beautiful minds inspire others so let me open that you will see that the texture is actually very interesting it's not your typical um blank notebook there is some texture going on but of course I chose this color for obvious reasons um, the downside of it is oh it's actually I think like not paper but anyway the downside of it is it's lying but I think we can make a something different with this so I, that's why I decided to get it as well and then what's interesting is I found this set of washi tapes colorful and creative seven rolls and the colors are actually very nice and they're not too thick but i would say i think they're durable enough for um journaling so i think they're pretty good i also got these sticky notes because i am such a fan of something as simple as this that we can use to accentuate some parts of the layout and of course i didn't go home without any pens miniso has a lot of different pens so i decided to get a brush one here it's in a minty color and then you have here a metallic pink one and i got a regular gel pen so that i can use it for writing in addition to that i got this from my stash because i believe it really fit with the aesthetic but this is a disclaimer this is from sostrene grene it's a brand from denmark that i got in berlin so I'm just going to use that to accentuate some parts. So for today's prompt, it's going to be um, today's adventure. Let me just show you the swatches of these um, pens. Oh, this is a very nice uh, rose gold-ish color and it's very dark. And then here you will see this, um, this is green-ish. It's actually lighter from the cap, but if you see it on paper, it's actually darker. So I think it's also nice. And of course, you have your regular uh, tech pen here. Oh, this is, I believe, in 0.5 gel ink pen. So today, I actually didn't do a lot of things, but I did go back to work and we went to Starbucks. And I just wanted to share with you this really nice packaging that we found because I ordered a uh, pour over coffee and this was the brew that they served to me and coincidentally it matched it matches with this color scheme so i decided to go for this as well as this and then add some elements from my washi tape so with this being the center of it 
I think it would be best to have it here in the middle just so immediately the top part is already secure so I'm just gonna get my um, dot liner again to tape it over but also if you noticed I can also have an option to put these sticky notes so what I like to do before putting on any glue is actually just plotting out how these will look like so it could be it could be something like this and then I could probably add this one here at the left side and then immediately I could use these um, pattern stickers to sort of establish a continuation because this is a line spread so maybe this white and pink combination would work because everything else is just very um, loud or this one would actually work as well so I'm definitely gonna use this one and stick it here but before that I'm just gonna secure all of these to make sure that they won't fall off the page so as I told you from my previous video sticky notes more so act as a um, adhesive or like an accent more than its actual purpose but Later, I'm going to show you some techniques on what you can add here on the sides. And then I'm just going to put this here. And I think something as simple as that is good to go. But since we also have these, I reckon we have to use some of them. Let me see if this color sort of matches this green. So I think that would be a wise choice. Unless we use this blue. Okay, the blue doesn't work as much. There's also this darker blue, more aqua, so this pink also actually works but it is too dark for me so I think my final option would be to add this at the bottom. So I'm just gonna plot that out. For washi tape that's plain, I just like putting them literally on the line like so. And then you see how the buildup of geometric elements starts from here. Like with, you have this circular part and then it goes to this like the curves inside the packaging and then here and then you move to the lines which accentuates the lines of the notebook and then you have this that sort of like rounds up the whole thing. So we'll start with the text now. It could be as simple as putting the date here. So I'm going to write the date here. The date would be October 22. 2019 and then you could probably write here that it's a Tuesday and then here on top could be a short headline saying today's adventure so the trick here is you can actually write over the sticky notes let me see if that works just be careful but it's also a great way of combining all aspects and I just wanted to round out this top part so that it immediately establishes what I did for the day so I'm just gonna write out what I did today basically went to the gym and was able to squeeze in Out. Next would be work session, Starbucks reserve, which is where I got this one. So this type of bullet journaling is actually a simple listicle which I think is really efficient especially if you're using a lined uh, layout because then you just put it in bullets and then it's easy to just you know put your words across and it's not that hard since it's not blank and empty. And then...
Usually when I do logs like these, it could be simple or as detailed as possible or sometimes I could also write about my future plans, especially now like I have extra space. So there, that's it. If you're not into writing a lot, this is a really great option for you because then you just list down your the stuff that you did and then you're basically done. So that's it for this spread and I hope you like it.